least Adachi-san seemed happy. Well, I guess this means our work is done. He did it all to draw attention. I, I can't get my head around that. It's just wrong. I mean, not that it would have been okay if he'd had a better reason. I know. Don't worry. It's finally over. Let's leave the rest to the police. My world will be peaceful again now. Yeah, I'm happy for you. We really went through a lot. Like scoring with guys. Oh, come on! Will you ever let it go? What? Scoring with guys? Y you don't need to know the details. I'm sure you'd like us to forget the sauna incident too, right, Kanji-kun? Damn, Yukiko is harsh. <laughs> she is really mad. Uh, w well... That's not fair. I wanted to see everyone else's too. That's right. We three are the only ones who saw everyone's secret. Yeah, but I'm the only one who's seen everyone's. Not everyone has seen yours, Yosuke. Hey, so what was Yosuke's like? Come on, it's about time you told us. Eh, it was embarrassing. Come on, let's leave it at that. Yeah, it's not my. It's not your fault that it, well, it's not his fault or our, my fault for that matter that you couldn't see it. Speaking of which, nothing really happened in your case, huh? Yep. Really? Wait, really? Is there something special about Senpai after all? Maybe. Sensei is the man. Who's the man? Now that the case is solved, we won't be calling you leader anymore, will we? Oh, yeah. That's kind of sad. It's fine, really. Oh, God. Hey, why don't we have a celebration? We always have a rap party after we're done shooting. It's fun, and it'll help give us some closure. Ooh, a party! That sounds great! Let's go all out! Ooh, ooh I want to go to Yuki-chan's house. Gorgeous dinner, hot springs, table tennis, yukata, geisha, Fujiyama, full witness! You're right. Yukiko Senpai's family runs a hot springs inn. A hot spring that Yukiko Senpai bathes into? Hey, keep it to yourself. You're sounding like a creep. Well, it sounds like fun, but I don't think it's possible today. Yeah, it's summer vacation. All the rooms must be occupied. We can't do a sleepover. Maybe next time. I promise. Hey, why don't we hit your place instead? Seriously? Oh, but will your uncle get suspicious? Like, why are you all celebrating? Yeah, fuck it, let's do it. And Risei likes Wait, that response. Let's head over right away. Oh yeah, if your uncle's a detective, he might not come home tonight. Nanako-chan might be getting hungry. Hey, then why don't we make dinner together? No, 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 no. No, no, no! We don't need to kill Nautico! Don't kill Nautico! Well, sort of. What are you saying? Did you already forget the tragedy of the school camp out? I think they have. Do you have short term memory? Because I don't think that's something one could easily forget. Those two days never happened. Kind of. I already told you that was an accident. I don't care. You must remember that. She's right. We just got a couple of the ingredients wrong. A couple hundred, maybe. 
Guys, please don't do this. I'm begging you. I don't need another trauma to deal with. Do you gotta call the trauma team to handle this if that happens? Hey, I'm a good cook too. I'll make something for you, senpai. Ta-da! Teddy has a great idea! Let's have a cooking battle! The winner will be crowned Iron Cook Inaba! A cooking battle? Now I'm even more worried. Sure! That sounds like fun. Aw, but I'll win hands down. You sure you want to make it that easy? Dude, listen to me. For the sake of our stomachs, you have to cook something too. Oh, listen to this next slide. I think it's this next slide where Yosuke references something. Help us, partner. You're our only hope. Star Wars reference. <laughs> then you can represent the guys team. Nanako Chan will be our judge. That's fine. You see, you girls have to represent yourselves. Well, it just takes one guy to kick all of your asses. That's kind of funny. But I like how Yosuke references all this shit. He's still not done with the references, guys. You're gonna leave a love what he references. I can be a taster too. Teddy can be a tester too. At the end, you're supposed to say, That was delicious! Right? This is delicious! Woo! I'm getting all fired up! Alright! Let us advance forth into the grocery section downstairs. Charge! Leroy! I'm gonna say that a lot. I think because of Kanji Jenkins. Surprisingly, I didn't say that at all in the dungeon. I just said Leroy. So I had to call Nanako to tell her about the cooking competition. Hello, Dojima residents. Oh, hi. Yeah, he said he's gonna be late today. Perfect. The plan will go into play. Huh? To plans. Nanako-chan what she wants for dinner. What do I want? I wonder what's for dinner. Um, anything's fine. She's just being modest. Ask her again. Well, um, an omelet. I'm down for some omelets. Omelet with fried rice. Interesting. So it's breakfast time. You ended the phone call, obviously. Nanako seems to be looking forward to it. Better not disappoint her. Fried rice omelet. An excellent choice, Nanako-chan. With a dish that simple, I doubt we'll get a second helping of Mystery Food X. But that doesn't mean they can't screw it up. The worst they can't do is not kill us with it. Huh? What's wrong? Mm, not that thing. <laughs> Alright, let's go get our ingredients. I don't... I don't think they know how to get... I don't think they know what to get. Uh, why are they going to different sides? Uh, if they're all making the same thing, why are they splitting up to different parts of the market? Looks like you'll need all the help I can give you. Hey, what kind of omelet are you making? I'll go get the ingredients for Yes, because Yosuke works for Juness. He has home field advantage. We are the home team. Orthodox ketchup flavor. Asian American soy flavored, herb filled province flavored, aromatic Mediterranean style. I'm gonna go with Asian American. Let's go with that. Let's see how it turns out. Everyone brought their basic ingredients to the cart. Foie gras? I think that's French. Quite an eye you got there, Senpai. It's a must have for my special omelet. Let's hope it's Don't okay. Don't worry, I'll let you have a taste. Ooh, or maybe I could spoon feed you. <laughs> I heard last time you choked down something so awful that words couldn't describe it. It was horrible. This girl's dangerous. She's insane. You poor dears. Who would do such a horrible thing? An evil kung fu girl and a girl that is the soon to be made character's waifu. That's who it is. Hurry, say 
Sun, this is gonna be the only chance you get to gloat. Is that clear? Oh, oh get ready for yandere moment here. I'll crush you with one strike. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. You guys look like you're ready to enter the ultimate frying championship. Mortal Kombat. We got Yukiko the Yandere right here. Chie the Sundre and Rize the Pop Idol. Kanji kun, that's alcohol. <laughs> what the hell, man? Oh. oh. <laughs> huh. Wow, oh, what a rebel. He just walks away. Oh, by the way, where's Teddy? Where is Teddy? Miss, am I allowed to eat this? Of course you can, dear. Eat as much as you like. You're such a nice lady. Is this one cooked already? <laughs> this one's ready, too. Oh, my. Are you hungry for more? Here, I'll open this one, too. You're so beautiful. Oh, my. No. No, I mustn't. I've got a husband and a son. But I really want this meat, and I want you to cook it, miss. Oh, I couldn't possibly. The manager would get so upset. I'm gonna knock the stuffing out of that bear. Fucking serious, Teddy. I will murder you, Akiko. Why? You freaking serious. He would hit on her. Alright. Yeah, this whole I do this whole recording so I just get to take out two parts. Alright, let's just continue on. Risa Chan was right. This celebration does make me feel like it's over. The case really has come to an end. <sighs> wow! It's really Risa-chan! Monica was like a fangirl right there. I should go back over there soon. Are you going somewhere? Yep, the guys kept their promise. A promise, huh? What if you made a promise with me? Could you stay then? A promise with Nana-chan? Um, a promise that you'll play with me. How about that? Sensei. You kept your promise with me, so I should go back over there. No, I won't let you. I can't let you do that, Teddy. But a promise is a promise. It's not good to break them. Now, I don't think I specifically said you have to stay in there. You coming on to, into the real world was something we never expected. So, yeah, I think you're good. You'll be lonely without you, Teddy. Your comic relief along with Brosuke. And again, everyone is. Everyone has their own comic relief moments, which is awesome about this game. You make everyone go in that spotlight at one point. My promise with Nana-chan. I made a promise to play with her. Can I really stay here? You better. It wasn't just my promise. Nana-chan made it with me. I'm really, really happy. Thank you. Teddy's eyes are watering. And apparently with that... We are rank 4 with Star. Teddy's social link has reached level 4. The power to keep persona as a star icon has grown. Yosuke, I have a new promise to keep. Damn right. So I want to stay here a little longer. Is that okay with you, sir? Huh? What are you talking about? You're not going anywhere. You can't just quit your job like that. In any case, if you left... It's ready! Incoming food! Out of the way, senpai! Oh god. Brace yourselves. Whoa! Ow! 
Okay, gotcha. You didn't have to smack him out of the way, you know. Bon appetit! Well, well wait a sec. Asking Nanako-chan to jump in and try these for us is kinda... unethical. Yeah, I'm really worried about all of these. Don't look at us like that! Uh, you're gonna kill her if you keep that. Oh... So it's our job to taste it first. Make sure we can keep it down. Hey, that's mean! Well, Risei, if your cooking is so good, then you have nothing to worry about now, do you? Then try mine first, Yosuke-senpai. It's guaranteed delicious! You don't mind me going first? Actually, I've been looking forward to yours. I mean, Rizet cooked it herself. Can you imagine how many guys would kill me if they found out? Well then, chow time! It's a trap! I... I... can't give this to Nanako-chan. Oh god. It's gonna murder Yosuke. Delicious that you won't let anyone else have a bite? Damn. I'm worried. Mm. It's spicy. The spicy that said heat are like lava in your mouth. You can't taste or feel the foie gras at all. It's starting to taste like iron. For some reason, you sense a dull pain in your mouth as well. You can't give this to Nanako. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, keep it away from her. Here, try mine next. I'll take this one. All right, it's bending time. Kanji, that's a lot. He's like, what the hell? He's just like, hmm. Like, he's just taking more. Hey, say something. Well, uh, it tastes really, um, boneless. What the fuck? How do you describe that? What? That's not a word you use to describe taste. Does it taste good or not? Tell me. Oh, I'll find out. Doesn't seem to be dangerous. But you don't sense any flavors in particular. In fact, you don't taste anything at all. Can't even taste the ingredients. How could this be? Not good. Uh, that's for sure. It tastes like... Like I'm eating plain oatmeal. It's pretty impressive that you put so many ingredients into a dish and it came out tasting like nothing. Well, at least they didn't murder us, so you're good, Yukiko. You're improving. Your palate just isn't refined enough. Palate? I'll have you do I've been to palate town and all the way around. I've been up and down it all around. Eh, it's safe for her to try it. I think it tastes good. Nanako-chan. She's just being nice. Okay, try mine next. I think I know her well enough to know if she likes it or not. Uh, I don't know about this, but I, I think it'll taste good. This time, for sure. I'm worried. I'll give it a whirl. It's nice knowing you, Teddy. He must like it if he's eating all of it. Wow! This tastes awful! You have to try this, Yosuke! <laughs> I love it when he does this. Like, this is awful! You have to try this, Yosuke! With such optimism, how it's describing how shitty it is. <laughs> Dude, not after you say that. Oh, I love that Teddy, that Teddy does that. Ah, I see. See what the problem is. It does taste awful. Well, um, it's a huge improvement over the curry. I'll say it didn't murder us. It's like I will murder you, Akiko. Yeah, thanks for the consolation. I feel so much better. We're such dicks. Even though we're not intending on it. Notice the hesitation to that statement. I seriously believe she's lying. Nanako 
Ocho-chan! Yeah, she's definitely being just nice. Oh yeah, they're right. They're totally right. It tastes awful. <laughs> she sounds like a black girl or something. A sassy black girl from Cards Against Humanity. She sounds like that right now. It tastes awful. Maybe not black. No, I think it's like a northern type of accent that I'm mixing it up with. I don't know. Then try Risa Chan's. I bet you anything mine tastes better than hers. Risa looks positive. Damn. Senpai? She did. How dare you kill waifu. Risei, there can be no forgiving. Sure enough. One strike. Ding, ding, ding. Well, Yukiko and Chie's didn't taste good either. But at least theirs didn't cause any casualties. <laughs> it's a taste too subtle for kids. It's a mature flavor. You guys are just kids. I... I... Oh god, that didn't sound nice. Nautico, no! It's spicy, but it's still good. Nautico chan! I knew it! Nautico chan's the most mature person in this room. You could definitely say you're the most immature, though, since you cried. She's younger than you. Crocodile tears! Oh, yeah. Didn't you make one too, senpai? Yep. So the non-hazardous one. You did? Oh. <sighs> this is really good. Wow. She sounds like she actually meant that. Never had an omelet with fried rice this good. <gasps> it's amazing. The omelet seems to be a big success. She's eating it extremely cheerfully. Monica finished your omelet. Are you full, Nanako-chan? Pretty good. We're still starving. If you're so hungry, then help yourself to an awful tasting omelet. <laughs> yep, when you insult a girl in any way, even if you don't mean it, or you're actually just trying to criticize her, she'll take it the hard way and you will hard- it'll- you'll be very little like less likely to be forgiven. Uh, I have a suggestion. You guys know about the festival they're holding in the shopping district, right? Why don't we all go? Oh, that sounds good. Whoa. Does that mean the girls will be wearing yukata? A festival? We'll bring Nanako-chan along, too. I can come? That settles it then. Festival food always tastes great for some reason. Even if it ain't anything fancy. That's so true. Festival food and just food like carnivals of it, they're usually good. I don't know why. They just are. Whew. We'll finally be able to get some edible food for once. Damn, we're almost at 59 minutes of the recording. or barely past 58. Culprit isn't finally caught. Arrest is up to the police inquiry. The festival is August 20th. You made sure not to forget this date. Will the time pass? It is now Saturday. <sighs> Damn. All you do for now is wait for the police to make their move. What should you do today? Okay, nobody bother me. I don't think anyone will. Okay, next time on Persona 4, we are going to do some more social linking. So, the killer has been caught, and anyway, if you like the video, leave a comment, rate, subscribe, check out the other videos, you know what, until next video, stay gold.